Hey guys, this is Josh F151 Tech back with another video. Um, and in this video, I'm actually going to be doing more uh, Metro by T Mobile 5G home internet speed tests. Um, so let's actually get into this video. Um, but before I start the video, I am going to actually say that I'm using a uh, tablet. Uh, SIM card. I'm actually using a uh, you know a third-party gateway um, with a uh, actual Metro by T-Mobile um, tablet SIM card. So I, I go over more about that in my other videos on my channel. Um, you know, if you guys you know want to watch those other videos, I'm not going to go you know really too much into it um, in this video. But um, I'm using a uh, twenty dollar a month uh, tablet um, SIM card. You know, it's supposed to be actually in a tablet. Um, but long story short i'm actually using it to get you know uh home internet um you know t-mobile 5g home internet or metro by t-mobile um 5g home internet in this case so um you know i'm i'm doing like testing you know phases with this um and you know i go more into detail about it in my other videos you know i, I talk about what you need um in order to do it you know and all that kind of stuff um you know to get it set up and all that kind of stuff but um long story short you will need a you know a third party gateway slash modem um in order for this to work um which i actually do have you know i actually have you know i'm actually gonna you know get into the video um and talk about that you know i actually do have a third party gateway slash modem um which is actually called a chester cheetah version 2 uh gateway slash modem whatever you want to call it um and that's actually hooked up to a waveform 4x4 antenna um that is actually up in my attic and i have that facing out near a, a old truck stop um down the road from me so um so let's actually get into this video um and actually see what speeds we get it is actually 8 22 uh, p.m um on a sunday so there's probably still a lot of people um you know up right now you know a lot of people are probably you know maybe getting ready for work tomorrow you know you know winding down um you know and all that kind of stuff you know probably watching some tv um or something like that you know before they go to bed um you know so i figured i would do a test you know today um you know before the weekend is over um so let's actually uh open up the speed test app here and see what we get and like i always do i am going to run some on the west norton pa server um and then i'm going to run some on the uh, ashburn va server as well So definitely not bad on that one. 607 for the download, uh, 9.76 for the upload, and then 40 ping. So definitely not bad. And like I said, you know, I, I am using, you know, uh, Metro by T-Mobile. You know, I'm using a tablet SIM card um, in here, you know, instead of the actual T-Mobile 5G home internet SIM card. So, um, you know, I'm, I'm testing this out, you know, more thoroughly, um, you know, before I, you know, make a decision if I'm actually going to continue to do this um, or if I'm going to, you know, go back to the Metro. I mean, by the if I'm going to go back to the actual T-Mobile 5G home internet, you know, if I'm going to keep the Metro by T-Mobile SIM card, um, you know, and use this, you know, this way, you know, to be able to get, you know, 5G home internet for only $20 a month, you know, I'm hoping that that's what I'll be able to do. Um, but, um, you know, like I said, you know, in my, in my other videos, you know, I talk more about it, you know, talk, you know, about how to do it, um, and all that kind of stuff, you know, it's, you know, more detailed in those other videos. Um, so, you know, definitely check out those other videos, you know, that are on my channel. So, um, definitely not bad on this one though, 630 for the download, uh, 5.25 uh, for the upload, and then uh, 39 ping. And I do actually apologize for not making a video sooner because I actually thought that it was going to storm earlier. Um, so I, I was going to make a video 
Um, actually, you know, after I made the other video, I, I put another video out earlier today. Um, well, I actually put two videos out, but the, the last video um, I actually put on my channel, I was actually talking about um, if my speeds were going to be, you know, slower um, after I uh, went past the 35 gigabytes um, of uh, data um, because on T-Mobile, or, or actually Metro by T-Mobile, not, you know, T-Mobile, um, but on, on Metro by T-Mobile, um, on the uh, 20 a month tablet um, SIM card or the 20 a month, you know, tablet, um, you know, plan, um, they can actually throttle you um, if you go over 35 gigabytes of data, um, which I actually did, you know, that's not really that hard to do, you know, since I'm using it as a, you know, home internet, um, you know, which is not, you know, really what it's meant to be used for, but, um, so long story short, you know, I made a video on that, um, talking about, you know, and showing you guys, you know, if my speeds were throttled, um, after I went past that 35 gigabytes of data, um, because after you go past that, you know, they, they have every right, um, to throttle you if the network is congested, you know, so, um, you know, I, I made a video, you know, separately on that, um, you know, to let you guys know and, you know, let you guys see, um, that I wasn't actually being throttled, so that's definitely a good sign, um, but, you know, if you want to check out that video, that's on my channel, you know, I go more into detail about it, um, you know, in that video, so, um, um, but definitely not bad on this one, you know, less than 600, but, the, you know, this is still what we average, you know, 500 to 600 on download, um, you know, so I'm still, you know, very impressed with it. Um, so 593 for the download on that one, 9.3 um, or 9.03 uh, for the upload and then 39 ping. Let me actually run some on the uh, Ashburn VA server. And like I did say, um, with the Ashburn VA server, um, I, I told you guys before on my channel, you know, it's, it's the same with the actual T-Mobile 5G home internet. Um, you know, um, since this is a further away server, I think that I get higher ping. Um, as you can see here, you know, this is 120 miles away from me, um, you know, compared to 27 miles, you know, on the uh, West Norton PA server. So um, that's why I think I get a higher ping, you know, on the server. So... Um, you know, that's, that's definitely not the ping that I'm getting, you know, 102. I can, I can show you guys in a minute that that's definitely not what I'm getting. I'll show you guys that, you know, I'll be able to download an app or something, you know, or open an app. And it's not going to be, you know, if I, if I was getting 102 ping, you know, I'll, I'll show you guys in a minute here. If I was getting that high of a ping, I would definitely know it. But definitely not bad on that one though. 612 for the download, 19.6, almost 20 for the upload. And, you know, it's saying 102 ping, but it's definitely not 102 ping. I'll open up ESPN here. As you guys can see, you know, boom, right into it. I'll open up the Google Play Store here. I'll download some random apps like Timu. As you guys can see, you know, it downloaded very fast. Um, I'll download uh, Sheen or Shine, whatever that is. As you guys can see, you know, downloaded without any problems. Um, I'll download, uh, let me see here, Paramount Plus. As you can see, boom, you know, downloaded it basically right away. Uh, I'll download Max. That'll be the last one. And boom, you know, downloaded it, you know, within a few seconds. So, um, yeah, that's, that's definitely false. You know, I'm definitely not getting 102 on the ping, so... Um, let me actually run a few more here on the server, though. It's saying it's 102 again on the ping, which is definitely not true. I 
But yeah, I do apologize for earlier, you know, I said I was going to make a video, but I, obviously, you know, I can't control the weather, so it didn't actually, uh, there, there was just a few claps of thunder, and then that was it. I was going to make another video, um, you know, to do, you know, more thorough testing, um, you know, with the Metro by T-Mobile, um, you know, SIM card, you know, from the tablet in the, you know, um, in the gateway, you know, in the third party gateway, I was going to, you know, do thorough testing, um, you know, more thorough testing, you know, with it, um, you know, when it's bad weather, but, you know, there was only a few cap, you know, a few claps of thunder, um, and that was it, you know, it wasn't, you know, really a storm or anything, you know, it didn't rain or anything, um, it's actually sunny out there still now, you know, it's, you know, the sun is going down, but it's still, um, you know, nice out there now, it's not, you know, uh, thundering or anything, or raining or anything, it didn't even rain, um, which I kind of thought was weird, you know, because most of the time when it's thundering, you know, it rains, um, but, you know, it didn't even, uh, rain, which I thought was really weird, so, um, but, you know, I do apologize for that, but, you know, obviously, um, you know, I have no control over the weather or so, but, um, you know, sometimes I wish I did, but, you know, I'm sure everybody wishes they did at, you know, certain times, but, um, you know, unfortunately, that's, you know, out of my control, but, you know, I do apologize for that, so, um, but anyway, uh, on this one, definitely not bad at all, though, 590 for the download, uh, 21.3 for the upload, and then 102 ping, but like I said, I'm not getting that high of a ping, I'm just ignoring that. Definitely not bad on that one. 615 for the download, 19.9, uh, basically 20 on the upload, and, you know, like 59 ping, but, you know, like I said, it's definitely not that high for the ping. I'll go back on the uh, West Norton PA server. Like I said, you know, this is only 27 miles from me. So, this one, you know, gives me more, you know, like more reliability, you know, more reliability when it comes to the ping, the speeds. Um, you know, all that kind of stuff, so, you know, I, I trust this server, you know, a lot more because it's, you know, it's closer to me, so... And like I've said before, you know, the upload is, is terrible in our area, you know, the upload, um, is gonna be anywhere from, like, 5 to 10, um, you know, sometimes a little bit higher, you know, like I said, I have messed with the band locking and stuff, um, you know, I've tried to mess with the band locking and everything, you know, be, to be able to get, um, you know, better upload speeds, but, you know, the upload speed is terrible, um, you know, like I've said on my, on my channel before, you know, it's terrible no matter what, um, you know, carrier you have, you know, it's just terrible, um, you know, no matter what carrier you have around here, so there's not really anything, um, you know, I can do about it, you know, like I said, unless you guys know, um, you know, of something that I can try, you know, band locking, um, you know, if you guys know of the 5G bands or the 4G bands, um, you know, that I can lock on to, I'm actually, um, in SA mode, you know, uh, so that's the, you know, fastest mode, you know, the standalone, um, you know, 5G mode, you know, because I have a, you know, third party gateway, um, you know, if I didn't, you know, I wouldn't be able to use a, you know, Metro by T-Mobile, um, you know, tablet SIM card in there, you know, like I, you know, have been saying in my, you know, videos recently, um, you know, you, you, you can't use a, another, uh, you know, SIM card in a, in a non, um, you know, third party, you know, gateway, basically, you know, you can't use a, uh, Metro by T-Mobile, um, you know, tablet SIM if it's not a, um, you know, third party gateway because you have to, you know, uh, mess with the IMEI, you have to, you know, revise the IMEI, um, and then you have to, you know, change APA settings, APN settings, um, TTL settings, and all that kind of stuff, so it's not, um, possible, you know, to do what I'm doing, you know, without a third party gateway, so, um, you know, just keep that in mind, um, but definitely not bad on this one, uh, 611 for the download, 3.54, uh, for the upload, I'm sure that'll go back up, um, you know, it does that from time to time, you know, it goes down, like, like, like 
Jeff said, you know, it's not going to always be boom, boom, boom. You know, it's not going to always be really fast, um, you know, or anything like that, you know, especially for the download or the upload. Um, you know, sometimes you're going to have ping spikes, you know, it just is what it is. You know, it's a cellular connection. Um, you know, it's not going to always be, you know, boom, 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 you know, fast. Um, you know, that's just, you know, how it is. I mean, obviously, um, you know, me having a waveform 4x4 antenna, you know, and third-party equipment, um, you know, like the Chester Cheetah, you know, version 2 gateway slash modem, um, whatever you want to call it, you know, um, you know, obviously that stuff helps, you know, I'm definitely getting, you know, faster speeds, um, you know, than I would be getting, you know, with the stock, you know, T-Mobile 5G home internet gateway, um, you know, for sure, but, um, let me actually run like two or three more here. It does seem to be a little bit, like, slower than earlier when I was doing speed tests earlier, um, but it's definitely not anything, you know, to worry about or be concerned about, but um, the reason that I think that is is because people are coming inside now, um, you know, they're, they're coming back home, you know, if they were out. Um, and stuff like that, you know, they're coming back home, um, you know, from wherever they were, you know, if they were out partying or whatever, um, you know, they're coming back, you know, starting to come back home and everything, you know, and get, you know, settled in for the night, um, you know, probably putting some TV on, you know, messing with their phones and everything, um, you know, so it's going to be, you know, a bit, a little bit slower at night, you know, that's, that's, you know, common with the actual, you know, T-Mobile 5G home internet, um, you know, as well, you know, I noticed that, you know, around night time, um, you know, on a Sunday night, you know, I've noticed that sometimes the speeds, um, are not, you know, as fast as I was getting earlier, you know, because earlier, um, I was getting speeds in like the, you know, 600, you know, 630, um, you know, 640, 650, um, you know, around that range, but it's still, um, you know, very usable, you know, by, by any means, you know, it's very usable, um, you know, it's definitely not, you know, anything, you know, really to be concerned about. Out. you know it's definitely still very fast um you know this is definitely a lot better than what some people can get you know for sure so um you know like i said though i'm going to be doing more thorough testing um you know with you know using the metro by t-mobile um you know sim card in here and like i said um you know i do go over you know how to do that and stuff on my channel you know i i talk about it more um you know i elaborate more um you know on it on my you know channel on my other videos with my other videos um um, so if you want to check them out, they're on my channel. I highly recommend, you know, checking them out. Um, you know, if you want to look into getting, you know, a third-party cellular gateway, um, you know, to be able to try this. Because, like I said, it's not going to work, um, you know, unless you have a, you know, third-party cellular gateway. It's just not going to work on another gateway. So, um, you know, you definitely have to make sure, um, you know, that you have a gateway that's capable um, of, you know, the IMEI, you know, revision and stuff like that. Um, but definitely not bad on this one, like I said, you know, 609, uh, for the download, 10.6 for the upload, um, and only 38 ping. Let me run, like, two more here. So, yeah, people are getting, you know, coming back, you know, home now, like I said, you know, they're getting ready for work the next day and everything, so... Um, you know, the speeds are going to be a little bit, um, you know, slower this time of night, but it's definitely, you know, usable, you know, it's not like it's, you know, 100 or 50 or something like that. Um, you know, the speeds are definitely, you know, very usable. I'm, I'm still very, you know, uh, happy with what I'm getting. So on this one, definitely not bad at all. 570, uh, for the download, 5.70 for the upload, and then, uh, 39 ping. Let me run like two more here. Broke 600 again on that one, so that's good. <coughs> so.
So definitely not bad on that one. 617 for the download, 601 or 6.01 for the upload, um, and then uh, 39 ping. Let me actually run one more here. So this is definitely a good sign, you know, that I'm not, you know, being throttled after going past the uh, 35 gigabytes. Um, you know, like I said, you know, I was, uh, you know, I, I was afraid, you know, that I would actually be throttled after doing that. But, um, you know, it's definitely not uh, looking like I'm being throttled. So that's definitely a good thing. Um, so on this one, definitely not bad at all. 525 for the download, uh, 3.81 for the upload and 39 ping. Let me actually run one more here to see if the upload will go back up. Because the upload, the upload sometimes does do that. You know, it'll go below 5 or 10. Um, it sometimes does do that, but most of the time it'll go right back up. So I'm not really that worried about it. As you can see, it is going back up, so that's a good sign. So definitely not bad on that one for the last one, 575 for the download, uh, 5.35 for the upload, and then 37 ping. So definitely not bad at all. So um, anyway, yeah guys, that's uh, basically the video. You know, like I said, I just wanted to uh, push out a video. Um, you know, that's probably going to be the last video for today. You know, I'll probably do some... Um, I might actually get up and do some, uh, you know, more, um, you know, thorough testing, you know, with this, like I said, you know, on the $20, um, you know, a month plan, you know, for the, uh, Metro by T-Mobile, um, you know, the tablet plan, you know, it's supposed to be on a tablet, but it's actually, you know, being used as my 5G home internet, um, you know, my, uh, Metro by T-Mobile 5G home internet, if you will, um, so, um, you know, like I said, you know, I have more videos talking about that on my channel, you know, you know, going over, um, um, you know, what the requirements are and stuff like that. You know, I'm not going to talk too much about it, um, you know, on this video, you know, but, um, you know, just so you guys know, I am using the Metro by T-Mobile SIM card, um, you know, the 20 a month, you know, tablet SIM card, um, you know, with the unlimited data, you know, and everything, um, you know, and I'm using that, you know, in my, in my Chester Cheetah version 2 um, gateway slash modem, you know, third party gateway, you know, whatever you want to call it. Um, so, you know, like I said, you do have to have a third party gateway, um, you know, that allows, you know, the, uh, IMEI revision and stuff like that. You know, if you're, you're, you're not going to be able to do this if you don't have a third party gateway, you know, just so you guys know, um, you know, I definitely, you know, want to be stern on that. You know, you're, there's no sense in even trying it because it's not going to work. Um, you know, they would find out eventually, you know, and they, and they would kick you off. Um, you know, if you don't, you know, actually, you know, like revise, um, or spoof, you know, is basically what they call it, you know, spoof the IMEI, um, you know, in order to, you know, get around, um, you know, them, you know, not seeing that you're actually using it for a, you know, a actual, you know, uh, third party gateway, um, you know, because with the, with the non third party gateways, you know, you can't spoof anything, you know, you can't do anything like that, um, you know, because they're not, you know, they, they don't have that kind of stuff, um, um, you know, in them, they don't have, you know, tower locking, they don't have band locking, um, you know, they don't have network mode switching, you know, they, they don't have any of that kind of stuff, so, um, you know, the newer ones actually do allow you to hook up an external antenna, um, you know, like the newer T-Mobile 5G home internet, um, you know, stock gateways, and the Metro by T-Mobile, um, you know, stock gateways, and I believe even the Verizon, um, you know, stock gateways, and the AT&T stock gateways, um, you know, allow you to hook up an external antenna, you know, that's well and good, um, you know, but you, you, you still can't do as much as you can, um, you know, with an, with an actual, you know, like third party, um, you know, cellular gateway, you know, you're just not going to be able to do as much, um, you know, as you can with a third party one, so, um, but anyway, yeah, guys, that's basically the video, um, you know, like I said, you know, I'm glad to see that it is working out so far, um, and I will keep you guys updated on this, like I like to say, you know, I like to keep you guys in the loop, 
um, you know, of what I'm doing and stuff, you know, and, and a lot of people seem to like my videos, so, um, you know, I'm really appreciative of the, you know, channel growing. I have over 300 subscribers now, um, so I'm going to keep this going, you know, for as long as I can. Um, you know, like I said, I am unemployed right now, um, so, you know, things are, you know, I'm hoping that things are going to look up, you know, for me, um, you know, in the coming year or so, you know, I'm, I'm hoping that, um, you know, I'm going to get driving, you know, like I've said in my other videos, you know, I'm not actually driving, I have my permit, um, but I'm not actually driving. I don't actually, um, you know, have my driver's license. So I'm hoping, um, you know, before this year's end, you know, that I can get my driver's license. Um, you know, I can get a, you know, a better job. You know, the one that I had, you know, really wasn't the best. Um, you know, but I'm hoping that I can get a better job in another school um, around here, you know, and I'm, and I'm just going to go from there. Um, you know, but in the meantime, I'm going to, you know, still post videos and stuff. You know, I'm getting unemployment um, and stuff like that. You know, I'm living at home. So, um, you know, I'll be able to, you know, post videos and stuff, but, um, you know, I'm gonna, you know, it's gonna, it's gonna be, a, you know, a struggle for me moving forward a little bit, you know, with getting my license, um, you know, all that kind of stuff, you know, so I might, um, actually take a break from time to time, you know, I might actually not make videos for a while, um, you know, from time to time, you know, I don't know when, you know, exactly that is, um, gonna be, but, you know, I'm gonna be working on getting my license, um, you know, my actual license instead of my permit, um, you know, I do have a car, so that's a good thing. That's a, you know, a bright side. Um, but, you know, I, I need to, you know, really get my life together. Um, you know, and sometimes, you know, you have to worry about your own life, you know, before you worry about, um, you know, making YouTube videos and stuff like that. But, um, you know, I'm not, I'm not going anywhere. You know, that's, that's definitely the main thing, though. I'm not, you know, going to go anywhere, if you, you know, for like years or anything, you know, long, you know, periods of time like that. But, um, you know, I just wanted to let you guys know about that. Um, you know, that I do have to get my life straightened around, you know, I have to get it, you know, I have to get my license, I have to get another job, um, you know, eventually, so, you know, it's, it's just gonna be a, you know, a work in progress for me, so, um, you know, I figured that I would let you guys know about that, but I, I still am gonna be making videos on the, you know, Metro by T-Mobile, um, you know, home internet, you know, 5G home internet, you know, stuff like that, um, you know, the Chester Cheetah version 2 gateway, stuff like that, um, you know, talking about third party party gateways, all that kind of stuff, you know, the, the actual T-Mobile 5G home internet, you know, all that kind of stuff, um, but, you know, like I said, it might be, you know, a while, um, you know, sometimes, you know, before I actually do make videos, you know, so I just wanted to let you guys know, um, you know, about that, you know, that I'm going to be, you know, also working on getting my life together, so, um, but anyway, yeah, guys, like I said, um, just wanted to get this video out there, and if you guys like this video, please like and subscribe, and until next time, guys.